Hello beautiful people. Today we are going to be going over eight items that we didn't realize we would love for our newborn. For those of you guys new to our channel, my name is Eric. And I'm Cody. And, and this is Zen. Baby Zen. And we typically do like daily vlogs and just videos of our lives. Um, but now that we have a newborn and we want to be more active on the platform, we decided to sprinkle in some videos like this. So I hope you guys enjoy our top 8 baby items that we did not realize we would like for our little newborn. Just a disclaimer here, all of these items are in no particular order. These are just the top 8 items that we kind of put together. Each item is going to be linked down below. All of them are Amazon links except for one that we could only find at Target. And this video is not sponsored. We are not getting paid for endorsing these. These are just our personal opinion. Okay, so the first product is nothing super life-changing, but it's the footy zipper. We pretty much grab for these almost every day, at least for him right now. He's four weeks old. Just for the convenience of the hand that turn into little, little mittens, kind of. It's just because he scratches his face so much, no matter how much we take care of his nails. And then also, since it has little footies, we don't have to put socks on them that fall off anyway. So I don't know if this means we're lazy parents, but it's just convenient to have them all bundled from top to bottom. Most footies with the zippers, they unzip from the bottom too, so it's easy to change their diaper as well. And just a disclaimer on this, this is the Kite Baby brand, which is actually, I think, is overpriced. The material is very nice, and that's what we linked, but you don't have to spend $35 to they get They have these. these everywhere, Target, yeah. Walmart, you know. Yeah. But we were just saying that we just, I didn't know we would grab for it as much as we do. Okay, the next item on our list is butt spatula. Mm -hmm. So the one, the one that we have here is the Bumco butt spatula. Let me get a close up there for you. I don't really think the brand matters other than you probably do want one with a little Suction. suction cup here so it can suction to the changing table or wherever you're going to be changing your little bubby um, But this is awesome because We had never felt butt paste before we had a baby and that stuff is nasty It's hard to get off your hands, but this you don't have to touch your hands with it. You just put a little here smear it on the butt cheeks and <laughs> Wipe it off with a wipe and then you are off to the races and then he can poop in peace without rash. He recommends it. Yes. Next item coming in at number three <laughs> is a product that's more for me. Um, it is the, how do you say this brand? Lanso? Lan Lansino. Lansino. Uh, they're just nipple shields. Um, it kind of self explanatory. Um, right now we are breastfeeding. I don't know if it's going to focus on this. There we go. So um, right now we are um, currently breastfeeding and can be pretty painful. So at least for him, he doesn't have any like nipple confusion or whatever. He latches to me, he latches to these. Eric feeds him bottles, he likes pacifier. He's not really picky, so I don't really have any issues with those. But these, they really help give me a break for a little bit. I don't exclusively use these. I just use them for a little bit and then once I feel I'm comfortable to not use them, then I just put them away for a little bit. We didn't even know they existed. Yeah, our pediatrician told me about them. So I really, really like them. Um, if your baby doesn't have any confusion with <laughs> like that, <laughs> he farted. <laughs> That's a good one. All right, coming in at number four, we have got the Frida Baby medicine dispenser. It's basically a little pacifier here and you can see there is a hole right here for this syringe to fit into and basically help your baby have gas drops or help gripe water. Help your baby have gas drops? <laughs> what? <laughs> help give your baby gripe water or gas drops. It's just way easier than shoving this syringe in their mouth and pumping it in, which is what the medicine actually comes with. So basically it's just this pacifier, but it comes with this too. This is awesome because Zen has had a lot of gas that he's having trouble passing. <laughs> and 
He's been needing gas drops, he's been needing gripe water. This has just been great. So this next product is the Summer Deluxe Baby Bath. So this one was um, pretty affordable. I think it was $19 at Target. The Amazon link we have says $26, so at Target it's $20. We did kind of, when we were searching for bathtubs, we didn't really know what we were gonna want, if we were gonna want the cushion that goes in the sink or whatever. But we ended up getting this one. It unfolds nicely and then folds in a compact way to be stored away. But this, for us at least, fits in our sink. And I don't think we have a super big sink, but this little blue base fits in our sink. And then this kind of lays on the countertop without him. Like, obviously, his head doesn't hit the sink or anything. Yep. But anyways, we have footage of us um, giving him a bath. And he sits in it very, really comfortably. It dries super fast. Just in the beginning phases so we're not like breaking our back in, in our actual bathtub. This so, has been perfect. Yeah, we yeah. really like and it. Yeah. He Yeah, we well we kind of fill this, up the sink with warm water and so the water is able to come through the bottom so his butt his butt is like nice warm and toasty. But and this one thing about this is it grows with the baby. So you can adjust the way it goes yeah, up it and down. Sits up. I think it says it goes till six months, I think. Something like that, but it just, I think it's perfect for the sink. That's where I wanted to give him his baths when he is at this age, so. Yes. Okay, so go on. Coming in at number six, we have different kinds of swaddles. So, first one I have is the Swaddle Me Pod. Right here, let me throw that over the shoulder. It's basically a little pod, a little cocoon for a baby. It's just got a zipper up top, zipper down at the bottom for diaper changes. And the reason we think Zen liked this more than maybe a blanket swaddle or a Velcro swaddle is because Zen likes to sleep like this. So if you have a baby like that, I would recommend this one here. Their arms kind of fit. Their arms are able to kind of go up a little bit and, and also they're able to kick and wiggle their arms around. Some babies just like that and Zen happens to be that. And now he's kind of evolved into this one. This is the love to dream swaddle up. And as you can see, this actually has more room for their arms to move around, more rooms for the legs, and just gives them a little more freedom, um, but still allows them to feel enclosed and cuddled. Before Zen was born, I literally bought so many different swaddles. I'm not really sure why. Well, I kind of to try the different ones, but anyways, I have so many different swaddles for him, but uh, these are definitely ones that that he likes. Next product is a diaper garbage, yo. And the brand that we have is the Decor Mini. I don't know how we're saying, if we're saying it right. Yeah, I'm not but... sure, but Decor, and we have the mini version. Um, yeah. so it's just... We live in a one bedroom apartment yeah. in California. So if you know, you know. Yes. So we heard a lot about the Diaper Genie, pros and cons. I looked at them and I was just like, there's no way I'm gonna spend that much money on the refills when you could just get like a bajillion garbage bags from Costco. Actually, our parents helped us do some research on this and found this one. What's cool about this one is, I'm gonna try to show you here. It's got, you know, you can step down here to open the lid and then it's got this cover here and you put the diaper in there, obviously. Holds the smell, great, that's what you want. I think the other ones are like that. Yes, but what's cool about this is you open... <laughs> All right, so I just changed this right before the video, and you can see, this is, a, this is the bag here, and you can pull it down. It's like an endless bag, but obviously you have to refill it at some point, but you just tie the end of it and every time this fills up, there's a little razor blade right here on the door, lets you cut it. You just take the diapers, tie that up, throw it away, and then retie this. Close it up, and you are all set. This thing is cool. worth it. And the refills on Amazon for two refills, which supposedly holds 600 diapers, is 10 bucks. That we can, we can justify, right? I like it. By the way, we have both the trash can and the refills linked down below. Alright, coming up at number 8, last but not least, we have Baby Goal Newborn Glass Nail Files. It doesn't really matter the brand, but see if we can focus on this for you. This is just a glass nail file. 
These are $5 on Amazon for a three pack. Like I said, doesn't matter the brand, but I don't know about you guys, but we were nervous to trim our baby's nails. And when we brought that up to our pediatrician, she had mentioned these little baby glass nail files. Yes, and she recommended these over a traditional like spongy nail file because it doesn't leave the nails as jagged and we can confirm this is the best thing. It's not perfect, but for five bucks, highly recommend these. It's tedious, but when he's nursing or napping, it's just like, yes, just falling away. So that wraps up this video of these products that we wanted to share with you guys that we are loving so far. They're nothing yes. like too crazy, but we just wanted to share they were them just, with you. They were just little items that surprised us. So if you guys do have any questions, be sure to leave a comment down below. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like. Be sure to check out our vlogs. We're going to be posting those. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Sleepy guy. <laughs>